good day to everyone. In this video, we will see about the traceability matrix. Traceability matrix, it is a document which has got mapping between the requirements and test cases. We write the traceability matrix in order to make sure that each and every requirement, it has got at least one test case. Next, we will see the advantages of traceability matrix. Traceability matrix, it gives an overview of all the requirements. It will show us how all the requirements are linked to the test cases. And it will make sure that 100% test coverage is there on all the requirements. It is easy to prepare. And there is no special tool that is required in order to prepare the traceability matrix. It can be prepared in the MS Excel itself. Now I'll show you the example of traceability matrix. Here you can see the example of traceability matrix, how it is prepared. Next we'll see the types of traceability matrix. We have three types that is forward traceability matrix, backward traceability matrix, and bidirectional traceability matrix. Now let us see what does what do you mean by forward traceability matrix. This is a matrix which is used in order to check whether the project progress it is in the desired direction for the right product or not. It will make sure that each and every requirement it is applied on the product and each and every requirement it is tested thoroughly by writing the test cases. It will map from requirement to test cases. Next, we'll see backward traceability matrix or the reverse traceability matrix. It is used to ensure that whether the current project it remains on the right track or not. The main purpose behind this traceability matrix is in order to verify whether we are not expanding the scope of the project by adding extra code or the design or the test cases which is not specified in the requirement. It has got mapping between the test cases to requirement. Next, we'll see bidirectional traceability matrix. It is the combination of both forward traceability matrix and backward traceability matrix. Next, we'll see who will write this traceability matrix. This traceability matrix, it is written by the test engineers. The test lead, he'll give an empty format or the empty template and the test engineer, he will fill it up with his respective modules. Each test engineer, they will fill it up with their respective modules. For example, if a test engineer, he is concerned with the uh, login features, then he will fill all the details, that is the test cases names for login feature. Similarly, other test engineers, they will do for their features. The test lead, he will consolidate all the reports after everything has been filled up. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to subscribe to our channel so that you do not miss any of our video or updates. Thank you.